Today we're going to create this sunrise using some of the lines that we've learned throughout the years and also using our warm and cool colors. So we're going to start off with our paper and our oil pastel and we're going to start down here sort of close to the bottom and do our first line. We're going to do a zigzag line and we know that's the one that goes up to a point and down to a point. Let's create your zigzag line. And then right under it, uh, put a couple of wavy lines. This is the one that goes up to a smooth heel and down to a smooth uh, valley. Create two. All right, to make our sun, we're going to do a semicircle. So we're going to start here, go up, around, and back down. Try to make it nice and neat. And to make our sun shine, our sun rays, we're just going to draw some straight lines from our sun all the way off the edge of our paper. Make them neat, space them out. Okay, that's our drawing. Uh, we're going to put our oil pastel away. Uh, we're going to get our watercolors out and we're going to paint um, our zigzag and wavy lines, we're going to use our cool colors, which we know is purple, uh, green, and blue. And then for our sun, we'll use our warm colors, which we know is yellow, orange, red, uh, some pink. All right, so we're going to use our watercolor. We have our water and our brush. Uh, we dip our water, our brush in our water, bring our drippies over to our paint because what is the main ingredient of watercolor? Water. Correct. Uh, so we're gonna paint our sun first. So take your time, paint your sun using your yellow. If you wanna put a little orange in there, you can, but you can keep it simple. If your paint makes a scratchy sound, we need more water. If your paint is not spreading well, you need more water. All right, when you're done with your yellow, we rinse our brush off, rub our drippy off on the edge, then go to your next color. Uh, you can color or paint your rays any color you want. I'm gonna do uh, orange and red, my warm colors. And then when I'm done with my warm colors, I'm gonna come to the bottom and do my cool colors. Uh, when you're finished, your painting should look similar to this. It doesn't have to look exactly like mine. You can put yours in a different order, but make sure you're using your warm colors and your cool colors.